What's going on guys? It's been a little bit since I've done one of these videos, but I'm back. And I want to invite you along with me on the Everyday Athlete Series. Let's get into it. Alright, so in this series we're going to be focusing on mainly doing CrossFit. Um, I feel like that is the best uh, methodology out there to get fit and be an everyday athlete. So. Um, I'm going to be following the CrossFit Mayhem Everyday Athlete uh, programming. So today, day number one, we're going to start out with a warm-up. It's going to be one to two sets of 15 calories on the Echo Bike. And then we're going to go into 10 box step-ups. Then a 20-second wall-facing handstand hold. And then three wall walks to follow that one up. Um, after that, we're going to hop into our Metcon for the day. Um, it's going to be four sets of two minute AMRAPs. It's going to be 20 dumbbell, uh, 20 double dumbbell front rack box step ups. I'm going to probably be using like 20 or 25 pound dumbbells since I'm just getting back into this. Um, my strength isn't really there yet. Neither is my cardio, so I got to build that back up. So hopefully you come along with me and you build it up with me. But we're going to be doing that, and then after you're done with the 20 double dumbbell front rack box step-ups, it's a max wall-facing strict handstand push-ups in the time remaining. So, And then you rest one minute in between sets. So after the Metcon, we're going to hop into uh, a little bit of a strength piece. It's going to be a clean pull plus a clean plus a jerk. Uh, there's one, two, three, four, five sets. First set is two clean pulls, one clean, one jerk. I'm gonna be at uh, 145 pounds because that is 70% of my one rep max. Then I'm gonna do two clean pulls, one clean, one jerk at 155. One clean pull, one clean, one jerk at 165. One clean pull, one clean, one jerk at 175. And then one clean pull, one clean, one jerk at 180. These are all percentages of my one rep max uh, clean and jerk. Um, I will put everything in the description. I'll probably also put it on the screen somewhere here so you can figure out what your uh, number should be relative to your one rep clean and jerk. Like that. Prize is the open last year. Past in the run back. Yeah, I'm far ahead and got a run last. But we ain't letting up, we never done that. Ain't nowhere to hide. You ain't gotta see me come and keep me on your mind. Cause I be on the way. Yeah. You know I be on the way. Man on a mission, I'm a kid and you know I be on the way.
all up in the pain, you can't shake that All the way gassed up, full tank, man Moving too quick, keep the cameras in the playback Dang, so tell me how you feel with it You put a lid on it, I ain't got no chill with it This right here your problem, you gon' have to deal with it Lead on the line, high risk, that's the meal ticket Yeah, we ain't never fall back Alright, so I got five of those wall facing strict handstand hand -hand push ups. That's the first time I've ever done wall facing strict handstand push ups. Those are way harder than regular handstand push ups, but the uh, double dumbbell thing, that got pretty spicy too. My shoulders started to get tired from holding the dumbbells up in that front rack. Uh, I'm using the 25 pounder, so let's see what we can get on the next round. Never fault. Came with the hands out, get them off us. I'm 24 7 in the office. Pay attention, cause I ain't repeating offers. Yeah, never met a man I've been scared of. Careful, you gon' get exactly what you ask for. Careful, whatever you bring me, get in hand. Or I answer to no one, I don't need to hassle. Yeah, we ain't never fall back. Hold our ground where we at. Where we at? Huh. We ain't never fall back. Hold our ground where we at. That one got a little more spicier than the first one. But I grinded out seven of those handstand push ups. I'm really, really out of shape, so this is gonna be fun on this series to get back to pretty good shape, lose a little body fat, maybe put on a little bit of muscle, and just feel good through all this kind of stuff. If I'm gonna finish this workout, let you guys know what I get on the last two rounds. Then we're gonna hop into the strength portion of this workout. All right, guys, caught my breath. Finished those last two rounds. Third round, I got six. Last round, I got five of the handstand, wall-facing handstand push-ups. That was a really good one. I didn't realize how out of shape I've actually gotten, but I haven't been doing any uh, CrossFit workouts like this in quite some time. And uh, that's what mainly I used to do all the time. But yeah, I stopped doing it, started doing like little bodybuilding stuff, some uh, kind of strength work. And I just didn't do any type of workouts like this. And they really get you. So if you really want to get in shape, if you want to be an everyday athlete, do stuff like this because this is where it's at. So uh, yeah, I finished that one. Probably gonna take a couple more minutes rest and then set up my bar here and get into the strength portion of the workout. So if you want to follow along in this Everyday Athlete series, be sure to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I upload videos just like this. And yeah, I'm gonna hop into this uh, second piece of the workout, the strength portion. Let's get it. Just hit a few warm-up sets here. Did 95, now I'm gonna do 135, and then get into my uh, working set, my first working set. At 145. I'm just hitting a clean and a trick. Just want to get my body feeling in, feel the weight a little bit, and then get into the working set. 
All right, boys. First working set, two clean pulls, one clean, one jerk at 145. Uh, this should be relatively easy for me, um, but I would be lying if I wasn't a little nervous to the last two sets at 175 and 180. I don't remember the last time I've done a jerk at 175 or 180. I'm not worried, too worried about the clean, but yeah, the jerk should be a little interesting. But let's get into this real quick. Hit this one, then we'll worry about those a little later. Clean pull. Clean pull. Clean. I'm all the way down, you and I am not for sale That's in case you couldn't tell, but you're no better now You can set me free or give me death, yeah Living good, I've been blessed, yeah Shout out all my enemies, all the best You can set me free or give me death, man I'm on my way, yeah I'm on my way Third set here, got 165 on the bar. Um, now we're just doing singles, so one clean pull, one clean, one jerk for the last three sets. 165 right here on the bar. Let's see what we got. Clean pull. Look pretty good. I think we'll be all right on the 175. The 180. We'll see. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. And I can do this all day, man. I'm on my way. Said I'm on my way. Real life better than the internet. Keep what you've been selling. I ain't into that. We are doing business. This is simple, man. All right, boys, last set of this workout. 180 on the bar. Haven't done 180 jerk in a while. Haven't put 180 over my head in quite some time. So, 175 felt pretty good. I think we can get 180. Be sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're gonna follow me along on this Everyday Athlete series. Let's get this together right here. going to do it for episode one of this everyday athlete series i'm so excited to be back on the channel giving you guys some content giving you guys workouts to do and i hope you guys just follow along with me and join in do these workouts too um if you can't do them scale them down a little bit but uh let's all get better together let's all become everyday athletes subscribe to the channel give this video a thumbs up smash that bell so you get notified every time I post one of these videos and let's all become everyday athletes. See you guys in the next episode. Set me free or give me death, yeah. Living good, I've been blessed, yeah. Shout out all my enemies, all the best. You can set me free or give me death, man. I'm on my way, yeah. Y'all can find out. You on time out. You've been dealing with the devil. Where you